over the past 20 years or so, the preponderance of transformation efforts that I've seen within clients and even in companies that didn't become clients have often been called, uh, have had a program name called One and then the name of the company. So One, name your company, we're, we're Hydric, One Hydric. Um, that is not a mistake, it's, it's, it's on purpose. Most organizations are looking for the power that comes from scale, the power that comes from unity, consistency. And if you're trying to access the globe and to access the globe in an efficient way, then doing so as one in a coordinated way makes a great deal of sense. Now, a lot of these efforts, either at the beginning or throughout, don't deliver on their promises. And there's a couple of reasons why. First is often not a great definition of what one name your company is. So being really clear about what that definition is and what you're trying to create. The second is the execution of the effort. So actually turning that idea into specific plans and, and methodologies across the organization that make it real consistently. But more so than anything, it comes down to the way leaders and the organization think. And the number one enemy to making one company work is what I'll call binary thinking. Binary thinking is black and white. You're either with us or you're against us. It's this or that, it's right or wrong. To make one company work. Now, it won't work if you become so rigid that you lose flexibility on the front end. So you're not able to be agile in the market and you lose your innovation. It also won't be uh, successful if you don't get the scale synergy and the consistency throughout the organization. That can't be solved with binary thinking. It requires a third way. The ability to think about agility and flexibility and innovation, scale and co coordination and consistency all at the same time. They used to call this paradox thinking but it's simply taking yourself out of binary thinking and thinking down a third path that gives you both, both and. If you can drive that sort of thinking through yourself, through your team and through your organization, it'll give you the, the platform to build one, name your company, that remains flexible, remains agile, but also captures the power of one organization.